Hi, I'm Dr. Lancelot Pinto. I'm a consultant chest physician at the PD Hinduja Hospital in Mumbai. For the diseases associated with water in its uh, different ways, I think it's important for us to prevent pooling of water and, uh, and trying to avoid breeding grounds for mosquitoes. So wherever you see pools of water, try and notify your local authorities uh, and request them to fill them if possible. Uh, try and protect yourself from mosquitoes as much as possible by using repellents maybe when you're stepping outside, especially in the, uh, in the evenings. I think it's important to try and not wade through water which is muddy, which is, you know, especially during the rains, if you see a flooded area to try and not walk through it because diseases such as leptospirosis uh, can spread through that. And if you do get a fever after wading through water like that, you should try and get in touch with your physician and see if any treatment is warranted at that point of time. Uh, I think these simple measures can go a long way in protecting ourselves uh, from uh, mosquito-related illnesses. Food quality, water quality tends to be highly suspect during the monsoons as well due to unhygienic conditions. So please try and make sure that if you're having food from a place uh, outside of home, make sure that you are quite confident about the quality of food before consuming it and be a little cognizant of the fact that one needs to be careful about the quality of water, especially at this time of the year. I think after two years of, of COVID, all of us are fatigued of having instructions in how to protect ourselves. And there is a, a little bit of fatigue from all the paranoia of diseases and wanting to constantly be reminded about them. But I think if simple measures can protect us, uh, especially at this time of the year when we know that there are a lot of monsoon related diseases, I think that can go a long way. I hope you all stay safe.